Welcome, lovely lot. It's good to see you here today to this energy upgrade and synergy upgrade for New Earth. Yes, we are still in the beautiful Lion's Gate portal of the, th of the three eights, and it's actually open until the 12th. So we are still in a way in that energy and frequency, and we're looking today at from today, so August 10th until the 17th. So what is really happening? I'm inviting you still to tune in to this triple beautiful gate, three eights. And of course, what we also need to see is the last eight comes from the year 2024. So of course, two is all about relationships. It's all about sacred relationship with the divine, sacred relationship with nature. So for me, really exciting. And the number four is of course, grounding it on all in. So yes, I'm walking barefoot again here in the jungle. I'm very happy to be home. Just arrived yesterday. So let us, let's see what we can do today with these upgrades. So these portals, as I said, there are actually three of them, 888. The eight of the two first eights, of course, are just eights like that. The eight, the date, the eight, the month. And the last eight, as I said, is 2022. And of course, zero also has a meaning. And zero actually means full potential infinite possibility, boundlessness. So if you like tarot, the zero is a little bit the fool, the fool who has the courage to make that evolutionary leap and break all limitations and break free. So what a beautiful combo with the 2024, having an eight that brings these additional beautiful energies to us. So what are we going to talk about today. Yes, these three different layers. And I got the message this morning and I'm really grateful. So the cosmic heart and all of my guides are really clear and they're really wanting us to go there. And I will give you, of course, a light language upgrade as well. So they are talking about three levels of abundance. So you have heard plenty about the lion's gate and yes, it's mainly about abundance. And abundance is not just money, as you are fully aware. Abundance is a harmonic state of being or beingness even. And so I've been given three different parts because of course we have the triple star gate, if you wish. And these three aspects is the energy of abundance. So they are inviting us to upgrade our energy to abundance. Now, when we get this upgrade, we still need to do something to access. So I give you the light language. There's other ways to do that, of course. There's very beautiful people who have done beautiful work for this lion's gate. So one is that you can access it. These are basically light codes. I think it's the best way that I can say it. So one is the energy of abundance and the energy of abundance brings us into harmony with abundance. As long as our energy is based in scarcity and the economic model of managing scarcity or limited resources, we actually don't have the energy of abundance. So there's two steps. One, it's available. Three steps. The second one is being able to access. And the third step is that you are using it consciously. In the energy of abundance is also the abundance of love. And by that, I don't mean only physical love, the romantic love, but also because this is also abundance. So then we have the language. And as you are very aware, language too is energy. And it's time for us to speak the language of abundance. And when we do so, we actually access now the truth and the voice of, ab of abundance. Very, very important. And we need to be aware that our language has been very limited. We talk a lot about don't do this, don't do that. This is not possible. No, 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 no. 
this is not the language of abundance. So here we are invited to access the language of abundance, which gives us the truth and the voice. And with the truth, we are manifesting abundance. The language of abundance is very, very crucial. And of course, our voice is really, really key. So please be aware of your voice and knowing that in the sixth dimension, as also David Essery and others are talking about, our heart chakra, our higher heart and our throat are connected. And they're no longer chakras that spin positive or negative. They are actually vortexes. So it's very beautiful that we can access this also in the beautiful lion's gate, the second part of the language. And the third portal is the consciousness. So consciousness goes with presence, but it also goes in dimensions. So in general, most of us are aware, or if you're here, you possibly really are aware, we are all multidimensional. But in a physical experience, human experience, especially as homo sapiens, we have chosen to be locked in a third dimension. So it means a lot of density, scarcity, disconnectedness, separation, fear, all these things, again, that we are very well aware. As we are now accessing this third portal of abundance, we're accessing the consciousness. And the consciousness is related to the dimension. And yes, I'm not talking about fifth now, I'm talking sixth and seventh dimension. And I wouldn't be surprised if some of us have easier access to the eighth dimension and more opportunity to ground it. Remember that 2024 also has the four, that for me is the grounding. It has the zero, the fool leaping into it. And it has again two tools that really allows us to relate to that consciousness, that presentness. And this is really now also exciting because my guides are telling me this is the synergy of abundance. So what does synergy mean? So synergy means that we're adding up some things or we're putting different elements together and their benefits and their outcomes are bigger than their, their numbers, if that makes any sense. So it's for me, synergy is a lot of magic. So here we are. So these are the three, the energy, the language, and the consciousness and the presence, the truth and the voice with the language of abundance, the harmony of abundance with the energy and the synergy of abundance. So I want to give you this little update and I'm feeling really blessed to be here. Yes, it's a bit dark, but it's already afternoon, late afternoon and, and the sun will go down soon. We haven't had rain, but the skies are a little bit, it's clouded here. But in any case, I am tuning in now again to the Lion's Gate and these three 888 portals. And I bring down for you this light language that upgrades your energy, your language, and your consciousness and presentness. So you have access to the harmony of abundance, the truth and the voice of abundance, and the synergy of abundance. Now remember, once you have access, it still requires your conscious choice to actually use it.
narimo narimo kurane namena ya ohi nare onire maho anata mine kolare maya tiramina nonirana me So just enjoy. These are upgrades that going into your physical body and the shift into homo luminous. So your DNA got an upgrade here. Into the new octaves of abundance. But of course also your symbolic body, your ability to make different choices to your thoughts your consciousness to your senses and of course to your luminous your spiritual your mystic body whatever name suits you and just let it settle for a moment Ooh, so how was that for you? Yes, so this is the basic energy update and the Lion's Gate finishes on the 12th. So for the remainder of this week, we are still having a lot of opportunities to look at self. So how is self really evolving? If you can spend time in meditation, spend time on your own in self-reflection and in self-exploration. The time with yourself and the time in nature is really crucial at the moment. It, it's like with all these upgrades that we have received now in the Lion's Gate, it's important that we ground it in. And the stars are really perfectly aligned. And it is all about the heart. So the, the Leo energy, but also Regulus, the, the heart of the lion, which is one of the Persian royal stars, is also very strong so it really allows us to settle into the heart to bring that heart grounding to really feel that awakening of the heart if you can and i missed it now for two and a half weeks walk barefoot walk barefoot in the grass let yourself connect this is really the energy that you can you can receive in a very pure form and this is what connects you with earth and connectedness and relatedness so the state of being connected it's not just connecting for a moment it's the connectedness the harmonic state of being connected and the relatedness the harmonic state of being able to relate to nature to the stars to the cosmos to the cosmic heart to whatever your spiritual path is and to your wholeness we are getting into the Aquarian age and it's not running away from us. It's very present. So this week is really crucial. So this is until the 17th. And then of course you will get a new one next week. And I'm very excited to see what comes through for next week. What is happening here for us in Sonkos worlds with the Sonkos? We are excited not only to be back, but also with all the energies that are unfolding and our projects, our unique offers. We've been very blessed in Lima, doing ceremonies, doing new series, working with really, really amazing people. We feel really blessed, we are grateful, and we are appreciating the new clients that came through for us and the ability to share this guidance into heart awakening, heart consciousness, but also into self in that shift and liberation of self, self-discovery, self-realization, self-evolution. And there's a new one coming and I'm sharing that with you as it comes through for me. And so it's very exciting for us. We are slowly getting ready for, for October in, in Sicily for the three retreats with six, six people each time, the hard fire. And of course, the 
Lionsgate has given me much more insight to this amazing retreat and it will be the first time we're actually doing the dancing with your heart fire to self to yourself and it's very exciting what's coming through it will be amazing the kind of connection and activations that you're taking away is way beyond what we could even imagine a year ago and the senate experiences are so profound that you know that your life is not not the same anymore and the connection to yourself and so yes we're very excited and of course also excited to have with us on at least one hopefully two we're gonna have beautiful georgia Vargas coming on coming in from spain and she will um, do two workshops taking you deeper into the spirit animals and of course what we're doing in the senate experiences in the way of writing and I can assure you she is simply magic. I will tag her, of course, in in the, in the, what is it called now? In the description so that you can actually learn a little bit more about her as well. So yes, the heart fire is fully on. We are putting out more online offers coming on a Monday. So if you're on Instagram, if you are here, I will put it everywhere so you have an opportunity to enjoy. We're going really into the heart awakening and we're giving you more insights into the different kind of eclectic magic we are using in our own way. It's always unique to how we are using it and it's unique to how you are receiving it. So it's a lot about heart awakening. It's about self. We could take on one more with um, mental health. We are very conscious about um, doing as little as we can in order to provide the quality and the attention that we want to give. So in a nutshell, this is it. And yeah, we keep you posted and we're excited to hear from you. We love it if you subscribe. We love it if you're part of the community. I know there's much more who are listening than are subscribing. But subscribing means we are in this together and I appreciate that very much. Love your comments. I answer each one. And I'm also listening to what you're really interested in, like the mystical stuff. And there will be much more coming. So let me know what you want me to talk about. If it's something I can talk about, I surely will. Sending you so much love from today, from the hammock. And see you soon.